spot nearby. Don't need any more of these last second rescues. You and me both, Tag. No lab on this side. I like it better already. All right. Let's see what we can learn from the locals. What's the plan with the toxin, Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm of the pod, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can listen on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. We still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution for that too. This door, Scorpio. Give me a hand. Huh. Peaceful. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared, Brad never told me why she left. Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. Guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers wanders into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. Music? Sounds like quite a party. Everyone must be gathered in that hall over there. Couldn't think of a better way to make our entrance. Come on, then. Hey, you can't just walk in. Just trying to find the quickest way to the hall. So, Hannah, been meaning to ask, you any relation to the coal train? Right, because every coal is related to Augustus. Sorry, was just curious is all. <laughs> Get the sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean, yes, he's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about Thrashball. I find it tedious. Guess this cold. No, I saw him play. That ain't what I remember him for. Man to legend. The true definition of the cog frontline hero. Yeah, not wrong, Ian. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but. The coal train. He's a quiet man. Thoughtful even. His introspection about the war kept me far from the military. He wanted more from me. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said, one serum and education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grip of the gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's, uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday, books for special holidays. I had books out my ass. Interesting. Oh, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. War? Sports. And I still don't want to talk about thrash ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? Through dad. Hoffman had the idea for this special project after what happened at New Hope. He had his hands on the New Hope toxin, but he needed a specialist to do anything with it. And so, here I am, working on a plan to save the world. You know, Hoffman's been working on this plan for a long time. But when I first got here, he mostly rolled around in his wheelchair yelling out the window. He really hates the First Minister. All right, 
Let's hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. Well, I hate parties. Little help here? Oh no! Everyone's gone. Oh god damn it. Looks like this ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Did someone turn off that damn radio? around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Gran told me why they hung. But I can try. This scroll references the Awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. Terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden, but let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. The spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. Fear. Awaken. Reborn. Renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden. Transformed. Light as the feather. Face the creature. Ha! Huh. Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? The feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu. A flying demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes, the Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here. We'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio. Let's head into the village. This way. Damn snipers! Shit! Where the hell did those bastards get here? How are we gonna handle this? We kill the swarm. Every last one of them. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
good to go. We've got your back. That's right. Thanks, guys. I just hope we're not too late. Let's go. There are stories of people who survived being snatched and potted. But... We need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple.
last of them. This just doesn't make sense. Even the locusts couldn't throw between the islands. That's why Sanctum was built on Dohanan. How did they get to Walegi? them here. No pods, though. No bodies. going to do about it. Make the fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page, sister. Your hive, we are coming! 
coming for the law of you!
We're not done with our hunt yet. Get the door. God damn. Look what we've got here. A silver bag. I think we can put that weak death machine to good use, eh, Scorpio? We can't move it without power. Mac, this is all you. On it, Keegan.
control of them. We're making this right. With every inch of ground, we take back. Definitely feeling the need for a win. Weapon overheating. More painter! on their entire species. I still don't understand how they got here from Pahanu. Looks like we found an answer, Hannah. The lava tubes. This is how they got here. Lava tubes? Then maybe they're connecting the islands. Hannah, above you! I can't handle. 